everyone, my name is Lancel19, welcome back to Let's Play uh, Fallout 1. So, need to find this razor lady. What do you do around here? I pontificate a lot and help the blades understand the true meaning of Coca-Cola. Nuka-Cola. So good about Nicola. It is the stuff of life. Well, actually, I don't drink it on an hourly basis. Well, actually, if I don't drink an hourly basis, I get a splitting head. Most of that stuff do you drink? About five liters a day. Alright, see something else? That's what the Nuka Cola is. Stuff of life. Uh, who's in charge around here? Who's just on the top? If you take his nuka cola, that will attack you, probably. I don't think I've seen you around here before. Can I help you with anything? If you, I'm Michael, my wife Christine, and I live here. As the blades help us with what we can. Tell me a little bit of boneyard. Got to move all that. I do only love you. Not as bad as it seems. The regular leaders and death claws can cause problems, but our leader, Razor, has helped us create over a great deal over the past few months. More recently, McRae has been helping us show us to protect ourselves better. That's probably her there. What do you do leader of this game? Gang or hardly a gang, but I'm going to it all come to for directions. Suburban sent me. No one loves what did he? Pay you back for killing his son. What? Those fucking pieces of shit bastards. I'll kill them. I'll send them all to hell. Um, there's uh, the regulators. They were the ones that killed Josh. I would never do anything to hurt Josh. It's regulators who are running anti him, not Zimmerman. The pathetic way to take your talk your way out of this. Why would the regulators kill the Zimmerman's son? Just lives here with me, eh, I mean us. He knew the truth behind what was going on. The regulators told him that if he ever tried to contact his father or return to Anne Tim, they would kill him. They laughed at him and they were so sure he'd get it. His father. They killed him? What did he do? Late one night, he tried to sneak back into town to tell his father what was really going on. I was monitoring the regulators' radio transmissions that night and they got, and he got caught. It's all on this hollow disk. Why haven't you given this to Josh's father? Not like any of us could get close to him, we'd be shot before we even reached the gates. I give him the disc. Risk your life to help us? Sure, anything to help. Not sure it would help without the threat of some violence to back it up, but we really need are some weapons from the gun runners. Well, where are these gun runners? Why don't you go get some weapons from them? A little to the east of here, but there's a death claw nest between us and them. We've never spoken with any of the gun runners. Okay, give me the hell of this, and I'll go talk to the gun runners before I approach them. Okay, this could really help us. Good luck. See you later. Okay. Alright, I need to... Take a look at the walkthrough. Yourself and return to Razor, you get 500 XP if you go back and pay. Play back regular transmission. East of the abandoned warehouse area, there'll be two death claws here, which you can kill for 1000 combat XP each. 
progress for an hour, you can leave the map and return and there will be new ones. Killing lots of death claws is one way to get enough HP to reach the level 21. Go east, the Leonar is telling them to trade for some reason. The one that's option when you cross the line patch area, but bonus you have good agility, you may take lots of damage and your PCs might too. Talk to Gabriel, he give you the task of exterminating the death claws. <coughs> Gotta go east twice to go talk to the gun runners, and we're gonna have to kill a death claw on the way, so. Two death claws, I think. Oh gosh, I'm gonna sneeze. Oh, sorry. I forgot that there was more death claws in the game. I must not have done this quest the first time. I don't know why I didn't. Slow old dog meat. You get to move twice, buddy. He can take that much damage from the plasma rifle. Wonder if these death claws are stronger than one we thought before. That's possible, I suppose. Okay, somewhere in this death claw area, though, is the parts that guy needs. I'm just gonna look up specifically where they are here. from the corpse from the ground my body is decomposed. Is there some kind of corpse around here somewhere? Should, should probably be doing all this in the daytime. Let's uh, if I rest that other one will respawn again. Explore in the dark. Loot is not my concern anymore, really. Unless it's ammo for the plasma rifle. More or less. Oh, there's the corpse, okay. I should have been watching. I was just looking for where the exit to where the, uh, you fucking kidding me, right? Like, I don't even believe that's possible. I had like a 95% chance to kill him and 95% chance to hit him. Probably a 0% chance to miss. I mean, 0% chance to critically fail, hit someone else. A 
fucking dog meat, man. He's really what makes the game hard, just, just trying to keep him alive. Guess we got a crit in that time. I'm getting hit more now than I was when I was wearing freaking leather armor fighting these things. Definitely stronger than the last one. The guy is totally gonna shoot dogs. to mention that when I was selling my stuff off in the hub last time, instead of going to the gun dealer to sell one of the items, I went to the drug dealer and got a bunch of super stim packs from him. So yay. Is that just regular junk? I probably could have kept my other junk and not even had to grab this. Yeah. Well, whatever. Kinda had a feeling that was the case because they did say it was for two missions. weapons. Speak to your boss is really important. It's not like a bomb over your
of these guys is the main person. Decennium. I'm Zach going to battle him. Let's see what he got. Uh, but here's where the good stuff is. I knew there was a place like this somewhere. We're gonna want that. Take this wrong launcher and give me all this. Of course, it's not gonna give me that many. Dude, I'm giving you a fracking rocket launcher. Rocket launcher. What the hell, I had a piece of plastic stuck on my shirt. It was weirding me out there for... I was annoying me there all day a bit. People were laughing at that, huh? Okay. Uh, we got our money and our uh, ammo. supposed to talk to this guy maybe? Uh, with large one arm man, that makes sense. How uh, often we don't get we get visitors? How may I help you? I don't get very many visitors. This place isn't very accessible with the midst of those damn death claws right outside our factory. I don't seriously feel all harmed, why don't you exterminate them? Go over there and take out a few, but they always seem to come back besides for machine to fighters. What would you give me if I went in there and took care of them for you? You can name your price. I have some friends who could release something to someone. I don't the desk calls all and make you up yourself a video. Okay, I'll do it. Okay, so we can farm these death claws. I'm not sure how much I wanna do that though. We can get three thousand each time. I might just do one level's worth of it. I'm not sure I wanna bother with much more of it. Let's uh rest at this location. Okay. What the fuck happened to my health?
hit, hit him pretty hard that time. Oh, that's pretty good. Okay, let's uh. Rest a couple hours. All out again. Think of this. Uh, let's check. For... No. We're not gonna do this much. We're just gonna do it till we level up. Ooh, okay. Not good. I do need to get like a. I don't like miniguns, but I should get a minigun for a point blank uh, emergency fuck it button. For moments like that. Don't kill dog meat, please. Chase me at this point, so. Yeah, dog meat gotta kill a uh, freaking death claw. He's gonna need health though, I think. Oh yeah, he's uh. He's hurting. me to get addicted to stim packs? I have no idea. Probably not. Oh yeah, we have to uh, we have to rest an hour here though actually. Let's try going in from like over here. All the Deathclaw bodies are still here. Specifically took the route that put him most in the way. Oh shit, that should have been enough to kill him. Really? It has that much? Okay. Jesus Christ. Just like a critical back on him for that.
totally be a shot. Quickly hit for 85 damage and knocked to the ground. Nice. First time I've ever knocked down a deathclaw, I think. He's pissed. There. I forgot I can't rest here. Once again. Fuck you, game. I can rest where I want. I should kill you. Oh shit, there's a death claw still alive. Maybe that's why. That's what we want. Let me go check. To get a turbo plasma rifle, which I think will bring our AP down to two. So I don't think Action Boy will help us. We should probably get better criticals on. Oops, that's been my point. Pretty much just all on energy weapons at this point. Okay, we don't have to spam that anymore, so we can actually go kill that Deathclaw Queen. Whatever she is. That's the Interplay logo. Uh, it doesn't really describe where the queen is. There's probably a ladder in the building that I didn't see. Or it might be behind the Interplay logo. I wonder if I can look at that. I probably can. 
graffiti. Nothing out of the ordinary. There is something out of the ordinary there. You're just not telling me. Oh, there's the ghost. Okay. Or the... Time to do it. I gotta have a save ready to go here. Because I didn't save it before the fight, so that's right. During the fight, I can probably make it to the staircase in like two turns from that point, so we should be semi safe unless uh, Dog Meat gets himself slaughtered. Brutally slaughtered. paces without any penalty to my armor class. Not really a penalty to my armor class, just uh, but I don't get that extra point of bonus if I move that third step that I had available. Fuck you, goddamn. Facing matters or how often you get knocked down. Action boy would let me reload and get a uh, get all three shots. It's a critical. Though. Try to use a pistol for that job, I think. Just to say you on the more expensive ammo.
something here. This is trash, okay. saw that, right? I just took three damage from nothing. Doesn't say I'm radiated on my pit boy. I don't know what the fuck's going on. Zach, even though I actually don't. You what? You killed them all? I think the guys. Now we can move to where we can move to where we can get all our own materials and not have to rely on those snakes and anti. You name it, you've got it, my friend. I have some friends you could really use on your weapons. You gotta let your friends know that they got their weapons. To invade anti on the on the I like to talk to the first. I don't think it's a good idea, but you're welcome to try. Uh, let me make sure. <coughs> Decline to help free anti on which case the regulars will disappear and you get 2000 if you enter anti on or anti -tan. To help, in which case you'll be teleported to the Antium if I freaks up between everybody. Maybe we'll losing everyone else. Note that important people like Miles the Smitty can die in this fight. So do everything else first. Once the battle is over, you get 2000 XP. Alternatively, you can tell the user you want to attack the Zimmerman first before the attack. If you shoot him, the Tomatist will be killed before. Let me kill this before. Eight armed blades will appear to fight. Normal, I get 2000 XP afterwards. Once the regulars are defeated, you can go to make a ray of the blaze and ask him for training, but this doesn't do anything. Also, talk to Michael and the blaze. He'll give you uh, forced impacts and random weapon. Plant weapons on the Addy Towners before the big fight to make them more efficient fires. 
We want to participate in the fight or not? Might be fun. Dog meat could die, which isn't fun. Let's get our business with Smitty and Miles done. Once we have the better armor and gun, then any fight's not going to even be a big deal. Them, but it looks like Smitty's going after the little around. Can you take it over to him? And I'll be back once he's fixed them. Oh, lag. Why is there lag on this game? It doesn't make any sense. Let's uh, save it. That was really strange. Okay. Okay. I might need to restart the game. Frame rate. you to fix these parts for me so I can fix your, uh, your yarn. Thanks to me to do your job. Thanks for helping you some stuff for your trial. I need some cats and some soup. Ever get back this way, you might want to look me and Smitty up. I might be able to help you out with some adjustments to some of your equipment. Smitty can work wonders on certain weapons, and I can help with certain sorts of armor. So you found some power armor. I've heard of a chemical process I could use to harden the surface of the armor. However, I'm missing some information, which will give me the last few clues on how the formula and regions would be necessary. I've heard the librarian in the hub is a staple town. has some journals and books there that might be able to use. Get those for me there. I could probably test the process on your armor. Sounds good. I'll go talk to her. Find yourself with a plasma rifle, bring it back here. I know a few tricks I can pull with the injectors. Sounds like you find yourself plasma. Yep. I'll take a look at it. Starts to tinker with there. That does it. Try that out for size. <laughs> Fucking burn my armor. Turbo plasma rifle, 35 to 70 damage. But more importantly, two action points to fire. Ho 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 ho. Oh man, they did, man, they did. Best gun in the game. There's no further, no further guns I need to worry about. We're done. We will go to the hub before we. Uh, well, if I can get up there. I think I was saying earlier, but I got interrupted. Um, <laughs> Smitty is actually in uh, Fallout 2, and he makes the uh, car for you. Set of chemistry journals, miles and antiums that you might need. You must please have loans he's looking for, it'll cost you seven or fifty bucks. Sounds good, here's the money. Here you are, sir. Oh, we have an inventory, by the way. Oh, there's some chemistry journals. Oh, excuse me. 
Bring this back. And then I think we will fight them. I think I'll do it in a different episode, though. But... Whoa. You're messing with the wrong dude, bros. I'm gonna kill four of these guys. <laughs> oh, it's beautiful. Oh, shit. I'm gonna kill five of them. I miscounted. <laughs> oh my god, we're so overpowered at this point. <laughs> Just disintegrated everyone. all of them with one round of shots. Why do they even try? Dude. You know what's gonna happen. Apparently following some rough terrain. They should use some environmental management out here. Okay. If I were you, see the fuck out, dudes. So watch my AC. His AC is th uh, 35, 20, 10, 12, 18, 12, 40, 80, 60, 40, 50. So after this, you have a chance to get to the, you know, read the books. Takes the books from me and starts flipping through them. Mm, yes. Well, I think I can figure out what it'll take. It'll take a full day for the mind to cure. Is that acceptable? No problem. And here, I'm back here. It seems to have a glint. Glint a little more than it had before. Well, I think it worked. Hard and power. Hunting process has improved the defensive capability of this high tech armor system. Armor class is the same. We've got the freaking resistances, particularly laser resistance. <laughs> Lasers are not an issue anymore. So that'll be it for this episode. We now have the best armor in the game and the best weapon in the game. Uh, we're done. So I hope you all enjoyed and have a good day.